Hey, what's up guys? Jacoby from jacobysjourneys.com and today we're taking a look at Parrot's Free Flight Pro app using the follow me function with GPS and visual tracking and whether or not it's worth spending $20 on. So I've been using the Free Flight Pro app to fly my Parrot Bebop 2 for a while now. So I wanted to talk about the follow me function and some of the good and bad things that come along with it. So in today's video, I'm gonna show some different clips showing the kind of footage that you can get with the follow me function. And then at the end of the video, I'll summarize what my experience has been using the app. So when you buy the follow me function, it basically unlocks this new little tab on your app. So on the left, you can see it has auto framing, which uses image recognition and keeps the subject in the frame while the drone's flying. And on the right, you see it says auto follow, which the drone will follow the target using your smartphone GPS and image recognition. Okay, so with Free Flight Pro open, I'm gonna go to follow me, and then I'm gonna go to the auto follow, and highlight myself, and then hit go. And with this footage, you can pretty easily do some pretty fun stuff. For example, you could throw on some cinematic music. Okay, so for this clip, you can see I'm using the auto framing function. And here I locked onto myself as I'm riding my bike. And basically the drone stays in the same spot and will just watch whatever the target is that you've set. So it will just follow you as you're moving around within the frame. Okay, so now I'm gonna use the auto follow function while I'm riding my bike. And this time you'll see the drone will fly with me as I'm moving. So it will keep me in the shot and you can actually move the drone in to you, as you can see, or you can also pan back out and zoom away from me. And also I can orbit around me all the way around in a circle. So this last clip is an example of when the follow me function fails. Typically I don't have a problem using it, but this will be an example of when I locked onto myself and for some reason the Bebop 2 goes kind of haywire and just flies off course or away. Fortunately, I was able to hit the stop follow immediately and the drone just stops in place. So after locking on, you can see it immediately just flew away randomly. I was able to stop it and fly back up in the air and regain control. So I don't know what went wrong, but this is something just to be aware of again. So this is something to be aware of, just to be careful that you're not flying in areas where you might hit a tree or a building or a person. So to wrap this up, the follow me function is a really cool option to use with your Pair Bebop 2. You just have to be really careful that you're not flying in a place where you might crash into something because the drone is gonna be flying on its own to a degree, so you just have to be aware of that. But overall, I think it's a really cool option and you can do some really cool stuff with it. So thanks for checking out this review of the Free Flight Pro Follow Me function. If you've made it this far, I really appreciate if you give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't, I appreciate if you subscribe to this channel. I upload new videos about travel and backpacking gear every week. Also check out my website, jacobysjourneys.com, where I have a lot of free travel and backpacking information.